Well, welcome back. Senator Amy Klobuchar announced that she was diagnosed with breast cancer recently. The 61-year-old Minnesota Democrat says doctors discovered abnormalities during a mammogram in February, which was followed by a biopsy that led to the diagnosis. The cancer was removed during a, lumpte a lumpectomy, which was followed by radiation treatment. And doctors at Virginia Hospital Center say Senator Klobuchar's cancer diagnosis brings to light the importance of not delaying care and preventative screenings. It follows a, C a recent D.C. report that found that 41 percent of U.S. adults had delayed or avoided medical care altogether, including urgent or emergency care and routine care during the pandemic. Sherry Citron, director of the Riva and Sid Dubery Family Cancer Resource Center, joins us now with more. Good morning to you. Good morning. And I know a lot of people that I know, friends, uh, have delayed their screenings because of the pandemic, not being quite sure of the protocol. Should they go in? Should it be virtual? Talk a little bit about that and the importance of, of maybe if you've missed it, really getting on board now with those uh, with those uh, screenings. Sure. Well, especially in the early months of the pandemic, we were all scared. Um, you know, we didn't want to um, get coronavirus. And so we did stay away. The recommendation was to, you know, make sure that um, there was enough uh, PPE and um, opportunity for very sick patients to get their care in the hospital. Um, so in the early months, about 22 million screenings were missed right. um, or delayed. And, but now we know that the hospital and your physician's office are very safe places to go. And so it's important to get back on track for those regular health care screenings. Are doctors making it possible for you to get back on track easily? Because I know sometimes there's such a backlog and you try to make an appointment and you're still maybe four months out or something like that. Are they, are, are they taking into consideration that so many people may have missed uh, very important mammograms or any sort of screening and making concessions for that? Absolutely. It, it has been um, made a very high priority for those people who miss screenings to get back on track. And that's why our hospital, um, for example, in our women's imaging department, have uh, made the hours much longer during the weekday. So you can come in very early morning before work or um, later in the evening after work. And you can come in on the weekends, too, because we want to make sure that everyone gets back um, to their regular screening routine. And in our last 30 seconds, just your overall message to anyone out there who is putting this off or for whatever reason uh, hasn't gone in, what is your overall message today? Screening saves lives. Please come and get your screenings. It is so much easier to treat you and to make sure that we can cure you uh, if we have the opportunity to get to see you right. as early as possible before any cancer has the opportunity right. to spread or metastasize. Sherry, thank you so much for that very important message this morning. We appreciate your time with us. Have a great Sunday. Thank you so much.